Hi friends, I really miss you. I miss seeing you every day, but I'm really happy that you get to stay home where you're safe. When it's safe again, I hope that I get to see you. Today I wanna to read you a story called, It's Not Easy Being a Bunny. It's written by Marilyn Sadler. If it's written by Marilyn Sadler, that makes Marilyn Sadler the author. That makes Marilyn Sadler the author. And it's illustrated by Roger Bolin. What does an illustrator do? An illustrator draws the pictures. So Roger Bolin drew all the pictures in this book. It's not easy being a bunny. PJ Funny Bunny was very sad. He did not like being a bunny. Look at his sad face. You can tell he's sad because his ears are droopy and his whiskers are droopy. He doesn't have a smile on his face. His mother made him eat cooked carrots every day. He had far too many brothers and sisters. And his ears were very big. I don't think that I would like to eat cooked carrots every day either. I think I would probably get sick of them. Can you think of a food that you would love to eat every day? I think that I could eat cookies every day. But that wouldn't be very healthy. It would probably make me sick in my stomach. At least cooked carrots are good for you. Hmm. What could you eat every day? Pizza? Salad? I don't know. Lots of foods to pick from. One day, PJ decided to leave home. I don't want to be a bunny anymore, said PJ. I want to be a... What do you think that PJ is going to choose to be? Hmm. He's leaving all of those brothers and sisters behind. That's a really full house. Let's see. I want to be a bear. And PJ went to live with the bears. How does PJ look now? Right, he's happy, he's smiling. Maybe he'll be happy being a bear. But when the bears went to sleep for the winter, PJ could not sleep at all. Living with the bears was not very exciting. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear. I want to be a... What's it called when bears sleep for the winter? What's that? It's called hibernating. They sleep all winter and then they wake up when it gets warmer out in the spring. I don't want to be a bear. I want to be a... Bird. He doesn't want to be a bunny. He doesn't want to be a bear. Now he wants to be a bird. Let's all start with the same letter. B bunny. B b bear. B b bird. What letter is that? B b b. That's the letter B. And PJ went to live with the birds. Hmm, he might have a problem living with the birds. What can birds do that bunnies cannot? Birds can fly, you're right. Bunnies can't fly. They are really good at hopping. Let's see if maybe that's a problem. PJ liked being a bird until he tried to fly. So smart. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird. 
I want to be a, hmm, what animal do you think it could be this time? Do you think it'll start with the letter B? Beaver! Does it start with the letter B? B, B, beaver. B, B, bear. B, B, bunny. B, B, bird. They all start with the letter B. And PJ went to live with the beavers. They all look happy to see him, and PJ looks happy again, too. Let's see. The beavers like to work very hard. PJ did not like to work at all. He has another problem. Beavers like to work, and PJ does not like to work. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird or a beaver. I want to be a, I wonder if we'll get another animal with the letter B. Maybe it'll be a different letter. <gasps> Pig! Pig doesn't start with the letter B. Pig starts with P. And PJ went to live with the pigs. But the only thing the pigs like to do was sit in the mud. Another problem. Do you think PJ likes to sit in the mud? Looks like he's leaving there. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird or a beaver or a pig. I want to be a, take a guess, what animal do you think it'll be this time? Something different. Mm. A moose! M, M, moose. Starts with the letter N. And PJ went to live with the moose. He's got another problem. What do you think it could be? Look at that picture. Mm. This looks like he's yelling. He's being loud. But PJ could not make good moose calls. Have you ever heard a bunny noise? They're really quiet, huh? That moose looks very loud says mook and there's PJ trying to make moose noises so PJ said I don't want to be a bear or a bird or a beaver or a pig or a moose I want to be a take another guess possum Look at those cool animals. And PJ went to live with the possums. Have you ever seen a possum outside? They usually come out at night. See, our possums around here are kind of a gray color most of the time, but you can tell it's a possum by that long, strong pink tail. What do you think that they do with that tail? They use it to hang upside down from trees. How cool is that? Kind of like a monkey tail. Oh my goodness, look what they're doing. The possums like to hang upside down. But hanging upside down gave PJ a headache. Another problem. So now what's he gonna do? He's going to leave and find another animal, maybe. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird or a beaver or a pig or a moose or a possum. I want to be a skunk. What do you 
what do you think the problem could be for PJ living with skunks? You're right, they're pretty smelly. I don't know if PJ's gonna like that. Bunnies have good noses. Make a bunny nose. They smell things. I don't know if that'll work living with some skunks. And PJ went to live with the skunks. It did not take PJ very long to find out that he did not like living with the skunks. Look at his face. Mm. Why do you think he made that face? Yeah, the smell. Ooh. Make a smelly skunk face. Oh, gross. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird or a beaver or a pig or a moose or a possum or most of all, a skunk. What I really want to be is a, what could it be this time? Bunny, he wants to be himself again. So PJ hurried home. The funny bunnies were very happy to see him. PJ was very happy to see them. Look, they're all waiting for him. Not like at the beginning of this story when he left, nobody seemed to notice. Mm, but now they're so happy he's back. That night, PJ ate all of his cooked carrots and played with every one of his brothers and sisters. He likes doing those things again. Maybe, maybe PJ needed a break. He was so happy to be a bunny again that he did not care that his ears were very big. At least everyone can see that I am a bunny, PJ said and not a, can you remember the animals that he was? Good job remembering. Bear, or a bird, or a beaver, those are all those b, b, b sounds, or a pig, or a moose, or a possum, or a skunk. Look at all those animals looking in his window. And that was a pretty good book. I think PJ found out that it was best just to be himself. Sometimes maybe you just need a little break. Sometimes there's things I like to do, but I don't want to do them all the time. Sometimes it gets boring and you need something else to do. But he's happy to be a bunny again. Friends, I really, really miss you. I hope that I could see your face maybe in some pictures. Maybe we could share some videos. But I really, really hope that you are safe and happy with your family at home. Miss you all.